He has a total of 79 fights, 61 victories, 16 losses, and two draws. In his group stage fights, he had a decision victory against Parandon Lek or Sedit Pan, a decision victory against Gao Chat Ronglien Gatiem Witeya, and in the semi finals, he had a KO victory in the second round against Nin Pet Ba Pai Dang. There you can see the tail of the tape. Suksawat, four centimeters taller than Tong Chai. However, Tong Chai with 79 fights to his name. He has 61 victories. Whereas Suksawat has 73 fights with 55 victories. So, quick maths. A better ratio of wins to fights for Mr. Tong Chai. Of course, it has to be said as well that Suksawat, he has fought on the Thai fight team before. A few years ago, he had a big opportunity. If I have to say it, to stay on the team, he didn't really take it, but... He's done well in the tournament. Yeah, what a journey. He came back to Thai Fight via Thai Fight League inside the Azuzu Cup, and he's done tremendous. Absolutely superb job. Tong Chai, on the other hand, he was a stadium star a couple of years ago, pre-COVID, and then he went away, disappeared right. from the scene. And now he's back again. The referee in charge for this match is Referee Pukit Pram Prayun. Judges are ringside. Song Shai, Kho Thong, Tawon, Yang Ubon, and Pajak Ngao Ngam. Oh my goodness, the oh. atmosphere in the stadium is electric. Just to give you a reminder of some of the fighters that have won the tournament before, we have Robert Gan Nora Singh, Lak Hin, Wasan Tasit, Anadzak Panyutapun, Panom Ruklek Kiet Mokao, Anuat Kao Samrit, Kem Sit Song Pidong, Shanak John PK San Chai Moi Sai Jim. PTT, Pet Rung Rung, and of course, Pet Tong Chai, TPM Gym. And that's just naming 10 people out of the 31 people who have won it before. That's right. It's a huge, phenomenal class of fighters. Great talent, and both of these fighters, they want to be added into that prestigious long list of champions. You can also name two fighters who have been runner-up. You might have heard of Kapitan Pet Yindi Academy. He was a runner-up. And of course, Super Bond as well, within this tournament, was a runner-up. That's right, the fight has started. Oh, what a start from Suksawat! And a return by Tong Chai. Tong Chai showing that he's equal in there to Suksawat. I mean, he's been trained by legends such as Diesel Noi. Just as well. Yeah, Diesel Noi is in the corner. He is, I mean, Tong Chai, he's not going to let the occasion get to him. And Suksawat, he's a man on a mission as well. He wants to get back into the Thai Fight team and represent Thai Fight in the Isuzu Cup super fight. Yeah, looking for that one-two combination with Suksawat. Tong Chai though, he's got his guard high. Lets the kick and then fires back the left hand. A quick start here from both these fighters. Attempted left up there from Suksawat, even acknowledged by Tong Chai. Yeah, excellent in this fight, being displayed at the moment. Always fought with gloves and we kept that tradition here on Thai Fight. That's why they're wearing gloves and not rope hands. Let's not forget that Tong Chai, he came in as a replacement in the tournament. Seemed like he had a bit of ring rust in the group stage matches, but he just seemed like he was getting stronger and stronger as the tournament went on. And in his last fight in the semi-finals, he won by KO against Nin Pet. And Nin Pet was on a winning streak. Inside kick there from Tong Chai. Attempted left kick up blocked. Deafening in here. We're right in the corner of the fans of Suksawat. Yes, we are on the other side. They are Tong Chai fans coming all the way from Chonburi province. Good combination once again by Tong Chai. He's hit Suksawat with that a couple of times already. Even though Tong Chai is grabbing a hold of that leg, Suksawat is connecting with that midsection shot and you can see the markings already on the body on the right side of Tong Chai. Yeah, Tong Chai needs to be careful because those kicks, of course, they do count. Both of them trading blows and neither of them refusing to go down. Seems like both fighters are looking for those hooks. And what a start it's been so far. Has. Very fast, very furious. You can see why these two fighters have made it through to the final. Exactly, and Suksawat has knocked everyone out so far in the tournament. A good kick return there from Tong Chai. Deafening in here, oh my goodness. <laughs> right, kick to the body there by Tong Chai. End of the round. Not an easy one to score. Stay with us, round number two coming up. Welcome back after 
that extended interview inter interval due to the interview. Both these fighters looking fresher than when they started. Here we go. Quick start from Suksuwa. Good high kick there from Tong Chai Wu. He's receiving some very aggressive instructions from Diesel Nori in the corner. Yeah, I mean, what a person to receive instructions from. And that has helped him greatly in this tournament so far. Suksuwa fighting on the back foot. Something we haven't seen so much of. So these guys are absolute lightning in there. Back to the center of the ring they go. Neither wanting to take a back step. Good combination there from Suksawak, but again, Tong Chai is looking good, defending his position. Tilted elbow there from Suksawak. This is close, really is. You can see again what I keep saying it why these two have made it through to the final. They are exceptional Muay Thai fighters. Oh, you can definitely tell both of these fighters have trained so well for this bout. Neither of them wanting to make a mistake, but both of them fighting safe for attack. Exchange of kicks there. Both connecting as well with those kicks, Kevin. Exactly. Good oh. knees to the midsection by Suksawat. Yeah, good left hand as well. Just before that knee. Yeah, that knee to the midsection, definitely the best shot of the fight so far. And another oh. kick. Almost putting Suksawat, uh, excuse me, Tong Chai off balance. This is beautiful work from Suksawat here in round number two. Quite frankly, it's not the first time we've seen it from Suksawat. Slowing down in the first round and then coming back with some hard shots in the second and looking like Suksuwat is taking control of this fight. Another big kick by Suksuwat and that connected. Yeah, just under the arm there. And again, Tong Chai grabs a hold of it but Suksuwat stays on his feet. This is a big round so far anyway by Suksuwat. Yeah, Tong Chai making the big mistake of trying to catch the kicks of Suksuwat but so many of those kicks are so powerful and they land very well. Suksawat using that height advantage very well. Good left hand there from Tong Chai though. Yeah, very good, but good dodging and good countering there from Suksawat. Another kick lands. Suksawat is in control of this second round. Oh, good stepping in from Suksawat, but a beautiful left hand from Tong Chai. And then moves forward for the kill. Suksawat seems like he's okay. There's no doubt that Suksawat was caught. The most significant strike. By Tong Chai so far, and it was a big one. Yeah, Suksawat definitely made it known to his opponent that he was caught, and he was caught very well. There's those kicks in the midsection are being caught by Tong Chai, who again is pushing forward here in round number two. Beautifully timed left kick to the midsection, so fast by Suksawat. Yeah, yeah. Suksawat managing to get away out of trouble. He's doing a very good job fighting on the back foot. But Tong Chai not letting up, he's still moving forward, trying to cover ground. Good left kick there from Tong Chai. But the left kick from his opponent, even better. Well done there from Suksawat. Oh, Tong Chai there being aggressive. Right kick, right hand, pushing forward. End of round number two. Wow, for all the folks watching around the world on Thai Fight International, it is as deafening as you can hear it, believe me. A beautiful display by both these fighters. If you're just joining us, we're watching highlights of the second round of the 32nd Isuzu Cup, where Suksawat, we believe, in the white corner, may have just taken that round from Tong Chai in the black. Yeah, he certainly did have some very significant strikes, some very accurate kicks as well as knees to the midsection, but Tong Chai, he did have that moment of brilliance where he countered Suksawat. Hopefully we get to see it on the replay, but there, there he is. Yeah, there it was. That left hand, just as Suksawat was looking for that left knee. Just a reminder to Suksawat that Tong Chai is exceptional as well. Yeah, that's without a shadow of a doubt. I mean, that's why he is in the finals. participants in this 32nd Isuzu Cup final. Well, Tong Chai stepping out first from the corner. Wow, just the atmosphere here. <laughs> oh, it's tense. It, really it is. is incredible. All right, here we go. Third and final round. Potentially final round. Left high kick from Suksawat. Oh, good right hand there from Tong Chai. 
this looks to what seemed like he was in a bit of trouble having to move out of it. No more smiles here from Tong Chai now. He's got that grimace, that mean look on his face. He knows that he has to do more than what we saw in round number two. Excellent block there from Tong Chai as he still continues to move forward. Left kick from Tong Chai. Talk to the Saimara Court team before the match. Oh, beautiful right hook there and from they, Tong Chai. They told me they had three people in the Susu Cup tournaments in the past and none of them won. Oh, wow. Pedro Ruhl on the other hand. They had PTT who's won the tournament before. And if Tong Chai wins here tonight, he will be number two from Petro Rung Jim. Left hook there from Tong Chai. Left kick to the body. Another right kick as well. Good combination here. Tong Chai on the ascendancy in round number three. Sook what? Not sure what he's doing at the moment. Really needs to start fighting back and he does knee to the midsection. Excellently executed. He might have caught Suk -Suk, uh, sorry, Tong Chai with an elbow as well there. Just bouncing off the ropes. Oof. Oh, a nice kick from Tong Chai. But receives a kick to the midsection. A much harder kick, I must say. Tong Chai moving forward again. Trying to find a way through against Suk Sawat. Goes for that left kick again. Suk Sawat though with that left kick to the body. Seems to be a big difference maker. Again, there you can see it. Exactly, that left kick has been money all fight. And when if things keep going this way, that, that's exactly what's going to win him this this is a cup tournament and without a shot of a doubt. And when Tong Chai does move forward, he's starting to walk into those counter elbows as well that Suk Sawat is very sneakily throwing. Suk Sawat, distance management on display here perfectly yeah, Tong, executed. I was about to say, Tong Chai finally manages to dodge one kick from Suk Sawat. He just hasn't found a way to deal with the left kicks from Suk Sawat. Oh, good right hand there from Tong Chai, knocking the head back off Suk Sawat. But the knee in return from Suk Sawat was that much harder. Suk Sawat still on the back foot, waiting for that left kick, and he gets it this time as well. Tong Chai again unable to find a way through as he leaps forward. Desperate moments here for Tong Chai connects with that right hand. And again, swinging with nothing to lose now, it seems. And he's been cut due to one of those sneaky elbows. And Suk Sawat points to it. Yeah, he should be pointing to it. The referee knows what he needs to do. He's been in charge for a long time here on Thai Fight. <laughs> Suk Sawat trying to get into the head of Tong Chai. Showing him that he's been able to cut him in this third and final round. Good right hand there from Tong Chai. Yeah, it's a right kick and a right hand combination. Grab with a kick and a return, and that is the end. Well, you can see the celebrations there on the apron of Team Suk Sawat. They think they've done enough to take home that D Max truck, that title belt, and that 500k. Yeah, the question is, though, do the judges see it in his favor? Yeah, one of these fighters are going to take home the Isuzu Spark, as well as 500,000 baht in cash and the beautiful. 32nd Isuzu Cup tournament belt. Oh, are we about to see a fourth one? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Just throwing that one out there. But what a fight it was. Two amazing competitors here on a tight fight lead. You see Diesel Noy there. Just working on that cut that took so what inflicted on Tom Chai in that third. Yeah, it was that left kick of Suk Sawat that Tong Chai had a huge problem dealing with. But you got to love the forward movement of Tong Chai and the combinations that he put together. Perhaps Suk Sawat may have been on the back foot a bit too much, but he was definitely accurate. That's without a shadow of a doubt. Good right hand there, we can see by Tong Chai within the replays. He did throw a couple of big right hands. Suk Sawat took them well. And he also connected with those left kicks to the body like Kevin was talking about, which I believe might have been the difference here. There was that elbow, those counter elbows as Tong Chai move forward. And he immediately opened up a cut on the left eyebrow of Tong Chai. You see there was acknowledged by Tong Chai and a little bit of whispering from Suk Sawat. Excellent timing from Suk Sawat.
about to find out the winner of the 32nd in Suzu. และผลการตัดสินนะครับสำหรับผู้ชนะในอีสุครับครั้งที่ครั้งที่สาที่สอง The Winners White Corner ส่งสวรรค์ใจเลย